Hello, today I'm outside 247 Austin Landing Road in Bluffton. This is part of the Cypress Ridge Complex. This is a four bedroom, three bedroom home being offered for $529,500. This home has a, a white kitchen cabinets, granite countertops. There is uh, LVP on the floor as we make our way into the home. We walk into a large entryway as I mentioned. Uh, excuse me, as I mentioned, it is uh, white counters and white countertops in the white kitchen cabinets in the kitchen. Um, oil rub, bronze hardware, large kitchen island, open floor living space. The master bedroom is on the first floor. Has an attached uh, custom closet area. And let's take a look. The home is three thousand. 181 square feet. The POA at Cypress is $1,356 per year. As you walk in, high, tall ceilings, open living space. Immediately to the right, if we walk to it, is the garage, which also has an entry display. It's a two car garage, tiled floor. Really good, solid size garage. Um, as I mentioned, there's LVP throughout on the first floor. This is your laundry room, which is right off to the right of the garage. The garage is right there. You have your laundry room right here with washer and dryer. Coming along that same area, you have your staircase going up with two doors right here. One is a half bathroom. Crown molding in the bathroom as well as throughout the first floor. Your other door here will be a closet. They use it as a storage closet. It could also be converted into a coat closet in the front of your house, but they have some storage right there on the first floor near the laundry room. As we come around, this would be your front door. Again, really high ceilings. This is the view from the front door. Immediately to your left, could be used as either a living room, sitting area, or um, dining room. Again, as you can see, shadow boxes, the ceiling, the crown molding, really well done. They have it just set up as a sitting area. It's towards the front of the home. As we come through that area, we leads into the kitchen. We walk into the kitchen, granite countertops, uh, pantry closet right here. This is a large island on the kitchen, dual sinks, white cabinets, a uh, gas stove. Recess lighting, as I mentioned already, crown molding throughout the entire first floor. This would be uh, all stainless steel appliances. You have your stove here, uh, dishwasher, refrigerator, all frigid air. This is the view. These are your cabinets. And then this is the view from behind the island. It leads into your living room area. You also have a separate eating area, which is right here, off the kitchen. Lots of windows on this first floor. Great natural light in this house. Again, the same LVP throughout the first floor. Coming back here, you have your Another closet, ton of storage. Another pantry closet. If you walk into the living room, this would be your ceiling. It's gotta be at least 20, 25 feet tall ceilings in the living room. If 
you have an area upstairs that you would be able to see into the living room, so almost like a balcony. This is the rest of the living room. Right off of the living room, if we take it around this turn here, there's carpeting in this room, just take note. This is the primary bedroom suite. This is on the first floor. Really good size room. They have a king size bed. And as you can see, plenty of room for furniture. Again, I know I've said it before, just a ton of natural light, great window light in this house. A ton of windows. You can see again the crown molding. Ceiling as we walk in. This would be the primary bathroom, again on the first floor. As connected to the bedroom, this is a view back into your bedroom. You have your tub and a walk-in shower. The floors are tiled in the bed, uh, bathroom. This would be your his and her sinks or just dual sinks if you like. You also have a little seating area right there in between the two sinks. Coming past those sinks to the right is the toilet as well as a linen closet. And as we go further into the, you know, so walking straight through the bedroom leads into a custom built closet, walk-in closet, great closet space, great storage. All custom cabinetry. The closet also has carpet. This would be the view back out into the bathroom and primary bedroom as we go through the house we can go upstairs now carpeted stairs you walk into a balcony that overlooks the living room just to give you an idea this is the space that you walk into you can turn it into you have enough room for a couple of chairs up there some type of seating area this would be your main landing ground for the second floor if we're looking out towards the back of the house to the left we have a full bath updated sinks as well as a insert tub and shower. Walking back out, so your bathroom is there. Immediately to your left and immediately to the right are two of the bedrooms. This is one bedroom. It's a smaller, the smaller of the two. As a Good size closet, as you can see. This would be your window space. We'll now head into the second bedroom. They have it set up as an office. Again, carpeting throughout the second floor. This would be your second bedroom, same closet as any other room. No crown molding in the upstairs part of the home. So just take note, but the ceilings are flat, good shape, no damage. There actually, there's no crown molding in the in the two bedrooms, but however, if you come outside, the common area on the second bedroom has crown molding as well. To straight across the hallway or landing area is again, another bathroom. Same sink, recently updated, it looks like. Um, tiled floor right outside of that bed, uh, bathroom. It's more storage. There is a ton of storage in this house. So as you can see, it's like a little attic space that they have. 
this would be looking back down the steps and then we come down this area past seeing area we'll have the third bedroom here it would be a king size bed in here just to give you some reference point as well as the same closets that are in the other two uh, bedrooms coming out of that bedroom head now to a huge bonus room that's up here on the second floor they just have it set up with a bed and a couch but a really big room it's got to be 25 feet long or so as you can see they have a sectional a queen size bed i mean just a ton of space you could do whatever you like with this room high ceilings again on the second floor now we'll head out back down the stairs it has a fully fenced in backyard as well as a fire pit there's a um, paved patio so hopefully you can see with the sun glare uh, this would be your patio great size patio they have it set up with a table with six chairs as well as a separate seating area Just if you step down, you can come around. Um, they have some storage there with kayaks, etc. But they have a fenced in. The fence is hidden with the shrubs. If you walk around, you can see the fence along the back area. You have uh, some woods behind your house and a couple of neighbors over there. But you do have the shrubs to provide privacy as well as a fire pit. I'm just giving you the walk around of the full yard again you come back around the other side and a fully fenced in yard with a storage area this is the patio right off of the home once again this is 247 holston landing road it's in cypress ridge it's being offered for five hundred twenty nine thousand nine hundred dollars you can contact me ron at the prodome team.com if you're interested have a great day and i look forward to speaking to you soon bye